for biology paper 6, there will be one question whereby they are going to focus on the planning of the experiment. So the planning of the experiment normally will comprise of six marks and the points that is required by the marking scheme is very standard for every past year questions. Okay, so the first marks that they are expecting you to include is the independent variable. Independent variable meaning that the variable that you are going to change throughout the experiment and this variable normally you can find it from the question itself. Whereas for second marks, you will obtain it when you are going to include the dependent variable. Dependent variable is the variable that you are going to measure or you are going to observe throughout the experiment. The third mark and also the fourth mark will be going for constant variable, meaning that what are the things that you should keep constant throughout the experiment. The fifth mark and also the sixth mark is a bonus mark for you in the exams because no matter which, what type of question that they ask you, as long as you include these two points, you will get at least two out of six marks for this question. So for the fifth point, it will be repeating the experiment. Whereas for the sixth point, will be the safety precaution. So for the safety precautions here, our answer also will be very standard. It's either you are going to wear the goggles or you are going to wear the gloves. Of course, if you write the safety precaution, you have to make sure that your experiment is going to use the goggles and gloves. So let's see what are the things that we are going to do for this question. So in this question, they are requiring you to identify the best temperature, the optimum temperature to germinate the tomato seeds. So the independent variable that I'm going for this question is the temperature. We need to identify what are the best temperature in order to germinate the seeds. Therefore, the independent variable will be using three different temperature and when you write the three different temperature make sure that you are going to list down what are the exact temperature that you're going to use and the temperature you should be reasonable it cannot be like a 80 degree or 90 degree so in this case i will put 30 degree 37 degree and also 40 degree c whereas the dependent variable is that we are going to measure how fast does the germination of the tomato sit? So over here, I can say that I'm going to measure the time taken for tomato seed to germinate. Whereas for the third and the fourth marks, constant variable, you can think of anything that is very uh, reasonable. For example, I want to make sure my volume of water is constant. If not too much of water, it causes a fast germination. If you do not place water inside the experiment, it causes no germination of them. Or you can write the type of the tomato seeds. You cannot use different tomato seeds. If not, the germination rate might differ. The germination process will be different. Okay. So for 5th and 6th marks will be very standard and we will not do much changes about it. So in the exam, you only need to focus on independent variable, dependent variable and constant variable only.